With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. A heavy particle is suspended by a string of length l, and particle is given a horizontal velocity v naught. The string becomes slack at some angle, and particle proceeds a parabolic path. You can see. Find the value of v naught if it passes through the point of suspension. So see what's happening. If this particle is having v naught here, it have some velocity v here. The condition is this particle should passes through this point when it proceeds in a parabolic path. So, so to pass this point, it this particle needs to travel. This much distance in x direction. So this is l sine theta, and this much distance in y direction. So this is equal to l cos theta, right? So the time to travel from here to here will be equal to l sine theta by. Let's uh, calculate the horizontal components of the velocity so you can see this angle is theta so this angle will be 90 minus theta so this will be theta so divided by v cos theta is the time in this time this particle should travel this much distance in downward direction so let's suppose uh, uh, we take downward direction as positive so it traveled this much distance so by applying the second equation of motion i am writing the equation so taking the down downward direction as positive so yeah so i i will put the t value from here v cos theta plus since i took downward direction as plus l sin theta by v cos theta whole square so what did i wrote here i just wrote this equation in vertical direction right okay so if uh, you will further solve it so one of the l will get cancelled out right so you will write cos theta is and this v will get cancelled out right okay so cos theta is equals to minus sin square theta so this l is get cancelled and here one l will be left sin square theta yeah this is sin square theta by cos theta plus g by 2 l square so it will be l since we cancelled out one l sin square theta by v cos square theta right so we got a relation between the thetas right so multiply the whole equation by cos theta so you will get cos square theta is equals to minus sin square theta plus here yeah, so we are multiplying cos theta both side gl sin square theta by v cos theta simple so from here we will get 1 is squash to z by 2 l sin square theta by v cos theta right now this v naught is to be calculated so we need to apply the work energy theorem from this a point to p point so let's apply the work energy theorem now here square will be there okay so the particle traveled a distance of l plus l cos theta and its velocity is changed from v naught to v so the work done by gravity is minus mg l 1 plus cos theta and the change in kinetic energy is final that is this minus initial that is this now at this point the string slacks so you can see here the only centripetal force is mg cos theta 
सो आई विल राइट एम जी कॉस थीटा इज इक्वल टू एम वी स्क्वायर बाय आर और एल वॉट एवर सो फ्रॉम हेयर यू विल गेट एम वी स्क्वायर इज क्वेश्चन टू एम जी एल कॉस थीटा सो जस्ट पुट दिस वैल्यू ऑफ एम जी एल कॉस थीटा इन दिस इक्वेशन एंड यू विल गेट द रिलेशन बिटवीन वी नॉट एंड वी राइट सो लेट्स पुट द वैल्यू हेयर सो फ्रॉम हेयर यू विल गेट माइनस टू एम जी एल आई मल्टीप्लाइड बोथ साइड विथ टू वन प्लस कॉस थीटा विल बी इक्वल टू एम वी स्क्वायर इज एम जी एल कॉस थीटा माइनस दिस सो एम वी नॉट स्क्वायर विल बी इक्वल टू थ्री एम जी एल कॉस थीटा या दिस टू प्लस दिस वन विल बी थ्री प्लस टू एम जी एल so we'll cancel out this m yeah so from here we'll get the relation v not square should be equals to 3 gl cos theta plus 2 gl right and from here we got gl sin square uh, theta by v not square is equals to uh by v square cos theta half is equals to 1 right okay and from here we know that v square is equals to gl cos theta so just put the value of v square here so gl sin square theta by v square is gl cos theta so into cos theta is also here so this will get cancelled out and 2 is also here so from here you will get tan square theta is equals to 2 so tan theta will be equals to under root 2 so we got the theta right now we can just put the value of <coughs> this theta in this equation so the tan theta is root 2 and uh, yeah you can see if this is root 2 so it will be root 3 right so further if you will put this values here you will get v not is equals to under root of gl 3 by root 3 or root 3 plus 2 and this will be your answer simple thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today